Hey everyone, welcome to Simply Learn's YouTube channel. Today we will learn about how to build a resume using ChatGPT. That said, if these are the type of videos you'd like to watch, then hit that like and subscribe buttons and the bell icons to get notified. Craving a career upgrade? Subscribe, like, and comment below. Dive into the link in the description to fast track your ambitions. Whether you're making a switch or aiming higher, Simply Learn has your back. Just for a quick info, if you want to upskill yourself, master artificial intelligence and machine learning to land your dream job or grow in your career, then you must explore Simply Learn's cohort of various artificial intelligence and machine learning programs. Simply Learn offers an artificial intelligence and machine learning postgraduate program from Purdue University in collaboration with IBM. Through this program, you will gain knowledge and work ready expertise and skills. That's not all, you also get the opportunity to work on multiple projects and learn from industry experts in top tier companies and academic teams from top universities. After completing these courses, thousands of learners have transitioned into an artificial intelligence and machine learning role as a fresher or moved on to a higher paying job profile. If you are passionate about making your career in this field, then make sure to check out the link in the pinned comment and description box below to find an artificial intelligence and machine learning program that fits your experience and areas of interest. Now, without further delay, let's get started. Now, most of you might have been an aspiring artificial intelligence and machine learning expert, or you might have been having some aspirations on different job roles like business analyst, data analyst, but you might not know how to build a resume that is ATC friendly, that is application tracking system friendly and get you a job. Most of you just go through the job description provided on LinkedIn, Indeed, Nokri or any other job portals and you just copy paste the uh, job roles and responsibilities and expect the ATS system to crack it or if not the ATS system, the hiring manager or the HR to click on your resume, right? That might not work in all the cases. So we have our AI friend ChatGPT to help us build the resume according to the job description and the ATS friendly nature of your resume should help you land your dream job. Now, let's take an example. Let's open one of the job portal platforms like LinkedIn okay so here i'll be looking for data analyst and here are my search results i have senior data analyst data analyst senior product data analyst let's go with this one which is about data analyst and here is your existing resume so let's say this is your existing resume and you have a a lot of things to add in here you have your education qualifications here you have your you know maybe the cover letter and you have your skills which are enlisted bottom in, in the bottom section of the resume right so it talks a lot let's say uh, these are not the ones which the uh, ATS system or uh, the hiring manager is looking for how do you make it a little more interesting to do is I would use chat GPT I would go to the job description here job purpose and job description I'll simply copy the job description job roles and responsibilities and everything right now or i'll go back to chat gpt and write a prompt just tell chat gpt hi chat gpt imagine you are a 20 year old or let's say 15 year old professional resume writer now i need you to check on the job description for a data analyst and help me with the cover letter resume so it should be a two-way communication most of you end up doing some mistakes wherein you try to extract all the information just in one prompt so i would uh, recommend you to keep it in a two-way communication let chat gpt know what you're up to let chat gpt know its role and responsibility right it should understand what you are expecting from it so i'm trying to convince it that it is a professional resume writer 
and I'm telling it to check out a job description which I'll be sending it in a matter and then I need its help to create me a cover letter and resume right now let it know about the job description okay I'll give you a job description you need to understand the key the key points of this job and critical expectations from the candidate key or critical expectations from the candidate here is the jd Now it is giving me some of the critical roles and responsibilities that this particular job role demands from the candidates. Now uh, you have all this right so you need a cover letter first. So give me a cover letter. Covering the top three responsibilities or highlighting instead of covering you can write it as highlighting in my according okay so give me a cover letter highlighting the top three responsibilities keep the cover letter under 200 words So here you have your cover letter. Dear hiring manager, I am writing to express my keen interest in data analyst position at your esteemed organization and uh, I bring expertise in three pivotal roles. Some of the uh, corporate languages that ChatGPT helps you with is the one key factor which will help you crack your, uh, you know, uh, the initial stages of the interview. You can just get a uh, a clickbait from the hiring manager and it's the best chance to get your resume selected now let us proceed with the resume right build me a resume using the job description so this is what you actually do but uh, i would recommend you to go a step further right now you can use this template it will give you a professional summary key skills required professional experience correct and education so this is not everything so what you need to do is take the key responsibilities right so you can take the professional summary as is given by chat GPT or you can enhance it based on your own words and you can give your basic details about your name, address, zip code, email address, phone number, LinkedIn profile, etc. You can go with the same professional summary or you can enhance it in your own words. And coming back to key skills, you can add your key skills here based on the profile you're adding. And uh, here you have professional experience. And here you just have plain English, plain statements, right? So what I would recommend is the plain English points will not help you. You can take the entire template as it is and when it comes to your uh, uh, professional experience i would suggest a few modifications here so these are the few modifications which will help you and your resume to stand up from the others correct so here you can add your educational qualifications your certifications and professional membership so in case if you have any professional certifications from uh, authorized organizations you can also take them and attach them to this particular resume and references will be available upon request now coming back to the critical modification that i was been suggesting you so when it comes to professional experience let's say i have this particular professional experience on my resume right so what i could do is uh, tell chat gpt uh, or you can also use the same uh, detail that it gave you you can copy this and ask chat gpt to quantify this can you please Fi my experience 
you can use terms like 15% organic growth ten percent reduction in expenses for advertisement is in increase the revenue per lead lead by 12 percent so you can just add on some numbers right so it will when you quantify your experience when you quantify your pointers it will help the potential recruiter to understand your potential in a much better way and your resume will also be shortlisted there you go you have your new resume here and again giving you some key notes on this particular area so what you can do is you can also modify or enhance these uh, professional experience based on the top problems faced by the company or top key critical roles and responsibilities that you need to fill right to solve those problems in that particular company and take those positions and secure the company right that's the overall point of it so ensure that these particular professional experience fall in line with these key skills at least the top three right and that will be self-explanatory for your recruiter and uh, the rest of the part is as usual so the chat gpt resume always follows the ats format and the only major difference what it makes is right the only uh, difference of what your resume and the rest of the people's resume make is the difference in the way you're quantifying your achievements the way you're measuring your capabilities and adding them onto your resume to catch the eye of the recruiter are the few things that matter and with that, we have come to an end of this session on how to create an ATS friendly resume using ChatGPT. And if you have any queries regarding any of the topics covered in this session, or if you require the chat prompts that we used in this session, or the sample resumes that we have, please do let us know in the comment section below. And our team of experts will be happy to resolve all your queries at the earliest. Until next time, thank you for watching and stay tuned for more from Simply. Hi there, if you like this video, subscribe to the Simply Learn YouTube channel and click here to watch similar videos. To nerd up and get certified, click here.